Ezio. Thank God you're all right. This madness with the Medici and the Pazzi, is this why you pursued Francesco? Not exactly. Well, whatever your reasons, the city's safe again thanks to you. Now tell me, how may I be of service? Ah, another page. Aha, it's a similar cipher to the last one. This won't take long. Interesting. Hmm. Indeed. I see. It's another blade design for delivering poison. Can you build it? See, it won't take very long. I just need to find a way to hollow out the blade without sacrificing the... It's all right, Leonardo. Just do what you need to do. All done. I filled your blade with a bit of poison to start with. Should you run out, just visit a doctor. Poison? From a doctor? In high enough doses, that which cures can kill. I am in your debt once more, my friend. Anytime, Ezio. Anytime. I've been sent from Firenze by El Magnifico to attend to some unfinished business. I'm looking for Jacopo de Pazzi. Ha! Who is it? We've been at it for days. And perhaps what I carry will help us both. A list of his co-conspirators. One of them will talk before he dies. Excellent. These men are sure to lack Jacopo's resources, which means they will be easier to find. I will put my scouts to it at once. I appreciate the help, Uncle. I've got something else for you as well. More codex pages. Ah, let's see what we can learn. What is this? What profit? What did you find, Uncle? Just another damn mystery. The text here roughly translates to only the prophet may open it. There's reference to two pieces of Eden, but these pages offer no answers, Nipote. At least, not on their own. You must find more. We'll have to save it for another day, Uncle. I have a mission to attend to. As you wish. Now, if you hope to defeat these bastardi, I will need to teach you a few things. Meet me on the practice field. All right, Ezio. You're familiar with counterattacking, but what happens when your enemy is as well? I don't usually give them the opportunity. Tough talk offers little protection against Templar steel. Then by all means, Maestro, teach me what to do. Now dodge. Feel your Detroit. Enjoy the ride down to hell. better. One last time now. Bravo. Uh, hurry up and die. I'm getting thirsty. Let's see it another time. One more time, Ezio. Magnifico! Once again, you exceed my expectations. Signore, we found Jacopo's men, and they wait your word to strike. Relay the following. No man moves until they have spoken with Ezio. Intesi? It will be done. Go, Ezio. Visit with my mercenaries in the countryside. See if Jacopo's lackeys won't lead you to him. But be careful. They will be expecting you. Ah, there you are. Listen. We've found Stefano da Bagnone. 
Just follow this road, and it'll bring you to the abbey where he's taken refuge. Wait. Before you go, take these. You can use them to create a distraction. My thanks, friend. Pray, brother. Pray? Pray for what? The Lord's protection. If you think the Lord has any interest in our affairs, you've another thing coming. But please, by all means, continue to delude yourself if it helps to pass the time. You speak blasphemy. No, I speak truth. But to deny his most exalted existence is the only rational response when faced with the declaration that there exists some invisible madman in the sky. And believe me, if your precious Bible is anything to go by, he is completely lost his mind. How can you speak as such? You wear his vestments. Only because they afforded me the opportunity to get close to the Medici. But you're right. I should look into replacing him after the assassin is dealt with. Oh, that unholy demon. At least on this we are... <laughs> now I will see who was right. Where is Jacopo? Nothing to fear, I suppose. They meet in the shadow of the Roman gods. Ora si libero dalla paura. Requiescat in pace. found Archbishop Salviati. He's barricaded himself inside that villa. Take some of my men. Use them to clear the fields. Then find a way over the wall so you can open the gates. Ah. Command over my own army. A nice change of pace from the usual sneaking and stabbing. I like it. Oh, that's 
traitor ran from the field at Corona. Many of my brothers died that day. This bitch died with flesh. There he is! The assassin has arrived! I need to find a way to open the gates. only in darkness to meet with the others. That answers when. Now tell me where. Fede dovrebbe dare conforto. Non pena. Requiescat in pace. Passo! You think you can outrun us?
Respect for death, my friend. I'll show you respect. No, I will. E tu possa al fine trovare riposo. Nel corpo e nella mente. Requiescat in pace. time you got here. We found Bernardo Baroncelli. Ottima notizia. Tell me where he is and I'll see that he's dealt with. That's the trap. Lorenzo actually had him arrested days ago after being returned to us from Constantinople. But he escaped. We believe him to be somewhere inside San Gimignano. Va bene. I'll see if I can't pin him down. How do you expect to succeed where the rest of us have failed? I have my ways. Free. 
in time. In time. Wait, what is that? I saw someone. Another mercenario come to spy on me. He's here! Help! So you can do to him what you've done to me? There is still time for you to clear your conscience. We gather at the church when a meeting is called. Mi duole dover giungere a tanto. Requiescat in pace. If I can stay my blade long enough to follow him, he'll lead me to his Templar brothers. I'll have more names for my list. What's going on here? Are they late? They haven't seen me, this much I know. What are you and the others planning, Jacopo?
Your letter mentioned Venezia. Are there Templars there as well? Grant killed my Zio Pino because he couldn't pay the protection fee. Did he turn somewhere? I've seen that man before. How many men are responsible for my father's death? Maestro, I did all I could, but the assassin proved too strong. Clearly, else the others would be here with you. To say nothing of the fact that Firenze remains in Medici hands. It's Francesco's fault. His impatience made him reckless. I, I tried to be the voice of reason. More like the voice of cowardice. You're one to talk, Signor Barbarigo. Had you sent us quality weapons instead of this garbage you Venetians call armament? We put our faith in your family and you repay us with inaction and incompetence? Then when asked to account for your failures, you make excuses and insult us? How do you expect me to respond? I don't know. It's all right. I do. Uh, uh, no. Please, no, no, don't. <laughs> Please don't what? I can fix this. <laughs> Spare me. No. So sorry to have claimed your prize, assassin. Did you honestly think I wouldn't expect you to follow? That I didn't plan for it? We've been at this a lot longer than you. Kill him. I know you're only doing as you're told. So if you release me, I will spare your lives. Ha! Let's... Ah! Oh, <laughs> 
Patsy are dead. Every one of them. I must admit, I've never before believed I could desire the death of others so badly. Nor I. Ezio, thank you for the role you've played in keeping this dream of mine alive a little longer. L'onore è mio, signore. What will you do now, figliolo? There are still others I must hunt, signore. They are already digging their claws into the heart of Venezia. No. La bella Venezia. Then that is where your journey must take you, Ezio. Before you leave us, I have something for you. A gift. This cape identifies you as a friend of the Medici. As long as you wear it, the city guards will be more tolerant of your actions. But be warned, it will not grant you immunity from the law. Che la fortuna favorisca la tua lama. 